Brothers and sisters of Celestial Energy, Brother Woodson, what's going on? All right. Let's get into this message about as far as our children, the children are concerned. Because one thing I do know is that we were tricked into focusing on this creature or this being called Jesus, all right, which is literally Zeus, artificial intelligence, all right? So, you know, it was the whites that introduced this whole Zeus thing to us. And this religion, you got Islam, which is a faulty religion. You're depending on somebody named Allah, all right? You got the Jehovah Witnesses, a false religion. You're dependent on someone named uh, Jehovah. You got the Hebrew Israelites, false religion. You're dependent on someone named Yah, uh, Yahushua, uh, Yahuda, uh, uh, Yahweh. I mean, all these different, and Yah literally means moon, all right? So you're supposed to be, you know, uh, Yah is, is, and when you say moon, you're not supposed to worship the moon, but Yah is, 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 the, is one of the ancient names of the moon. But yet, they don't know it. The moon is a feminine being. But we were tricked by mankind to think that these beings or these deities were uh, masculine when in reality, they don't exist at all. All right? Religion has caused a crunch on us as the original people. Religion has caused a crunch on in within everything, within every 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 facet of our beings, brothers and sisters. And we have to see that religion has literally destroyed the ancient uh, knowledge of who we are. Now, our children, as well as ourselves, are supposed to be very knowledgeable in the way of the force, okay? Our children, as well as ourselves, are to be extremely knowledgeable in the ways of the force. The ways of the force are the ways of nature and the cosmos, how to, how to be a part of this most beautiful, spectacular energy that gives us supreme powers, all right? If our children and our people were in tune to the force and we knew how to use the force, there would not be any stealing of our people. If we knew how to use the force, there would not be any killing of each other if we knew that. But this information was taken away from us. This information was hidden away from us so that we as the original beings would not know how to operate on a higher level. Understand this, all right? And this is how our enemies operate. This is how they, this is how they flow, brothers and sisters. They literally uh, 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 did everything that they possibly knew to do so that we cannot be uh, in this, this, this line of energy, all right? They needed us to not be in this line of energy because this line of energy is what takes us into that next phase of the absolute when we're tapping into that zero point energy. And that's a part of the force. When you're able to move your hands and you can move a whole body, make someone fly, in, uh, uh, fly across the, 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 uh, the room, or you, know, you can make something move just by using your hands. And that's the way, that's the way of the force. Okay, so this is why it's important for us as the original beings to carry ourselves in such a way that we would be learning how to operate in the full uh, magnitude of nature and the cosmos. Our children would know how to protect themselves because they would know how to fight against a well-known enemy who's steadily fighting against us on a daily basis. You understand that? They're fighting against us on a daily basis. You, you think that stuff they spray in the sky. You think it's just for, for uh, 
the, the to make it rain, to hide the sun. No, that stuff is chemicals that they spraying in the sky to try to keep us docile, to try to keep us weak as the original beings. All right. You got to understand how they operate. It's just, you know, just like, you know, uh, Sister Rabel said, she's like, she's like, she's like, this is this is not. Uh, 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 Bill Gates We, you know, we're not looking at Bill Gates Who's spraying the stuff in the sky We're looking at who controlled Bill Gates Which is the male, the Moors Alright, we're looking at who controlled Bill Gates Who controls Bill Clinton Who controls all of us Alright, because the Moors need us To not awaken Okay, so the chemicals That they spray in the sky, the stuff that comes from Those buildings, we're breathing this stuff in Which means that we have to You know, this, this wide constantly saying we've got to go into this place where we are literally finding ways to expand knowledge building and creating devices and machines machines of war you know this is where we are so we have to become in tune to the ways of the force but to find that place far away sometime i just take this this cell phone here and put it to the side and take me a couple hours and go into my state of meditation Therefore, I'm communicating, I'm tapping into the force, I'm tapping into the powers all around me. Therefore, when you look into the force, you're looking into what you call invincibility. You're looking into immortality. You're looking into to supreme energy and supreme power that cannot be broken. But religion can be broken. All right? Religion can be broken. You got brothers and sisters running around in the church, jumping up and down, hooping and hollering, talking about some Jesus and God and and praise Allah and praise the Most High and all that. Why are you praising all these beings that don't exist? Why? Why are you worshiping? Why do you, why do brothers and sisters come on this channel knowing that I don't do no religion? And they're talking about praise to the most high. What do you mean praise to the most high? What most high? What most high? Why are you praising something? Why are you praising something? The whole key point is that we've got to be able to link into a higher energy, a higher power, a higher frequency, a higher vibration. This is what we got to be, brothers and sisters. We've got to be able to bring ourselves back. But our children, our children are supposed to know the ways of the force. Like that little girl, she said, Mama, watch I move this, this piece of paper with my mind. And she held her hand out of that paper, moved all the way across the room. That was the force. The children are supposed to know the ways of the force. The grown-ups are supposed to know the ways of the force. The old ones are supposed to know the ways of the force. All of us are supposed to know the ways of the force. But so many of us are in tune to this virus program called religion. Hoping that somebody is going to come and save us and nobody's going to save ourselves. But we've been taught to hate the very thing or the very information that literally causes us to become more powerful. Understand us, brothers and sisters. It's time for us to be awakened to the force. It's time for us to be awakened to the energy, to, to the to the maximum power of everything. We're out here looking for money. Why we're not looking for power? You see brothers and sisters running around robbing and stealing and killing all the time. Why? They're looking for money. They're looking for something that's gonna that they feel like is gonna be a sense of power. We've been miseducated by a whole system of beings who came here to make sure that we didn't get the proper knowledge of who we are. How to tap into this energy how to become this energy how to become this force how to become this force this 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 you know the the force awakens you know that how how to become this how to become that i mean this is this is where we are brothers and sisters and we've got to see ourselves growing into a new energy we have to this is the we we can't continue to go in the ways where mankind wants us to go we can't keep continue to go in the ways where the moors want us to go we are nature. We are the most powerful beings in this realm, on this planet. There is no gun or bullet that can affect us when we are in tune with the absolute. But our children should know the ways of the force. Our children wouldn't get kidnapped. Our children wouldn't get hurt. 
because they will hurt those who are trying to hurt them if they knew the ways of the force. But so many of our people want to stick to this false stigma called Jesus, called God, called Jehovah. You got brothers, sisters, and Jehovah Witness who are literally just like say, oh no, if you're not Jehovah Witness, don't care if you family or not, we don't nothing do, want nothing to do with you. And they stick to this false religion. My people perish for lack of knowledge. What is the lack of knowledge? What lack of knowledge are they, or, or the, do they have? They have that the, they lack the knowledge of the force. They lack the knowledge of self. Understand this. I just want to make this quick message. All right. If our children knew the ways of the force, they wouldn't get kidnapped. If our women knew the ways of the force, they wouldn't get kidnapped. But it's everybody out there partying and dancing and singing, Jay Z and Kanye and you know all these other uh, rappers and. Lil' Kim and Sexy Red and all this other garbage and, and, and they're not going after what we're supposed to be going after because we'd be more powerful people if we knew the ways of the force. Alright? I'll catch y'all guys later. Alright? Just want to share that with y'all. I ain't got nothing else to say. Alright? Much power to y'all.